the urban stealth camper van man. You know it makes sense. A conspiracy free zone. It's time to panic when the highlight of your day, and I just not, I'm being deadly serious, the highlight of your day is walking around Tesco's, waiting to the right time so it's nice and uh, quiet in there, um, you know, timing it right, and then hanging around the bargain basement section, you know, and it's like a cast of extras, do, do, do you know what I mean? It is, it's like, it's something a little bit desperate about it, but something also enjoyable about it, getting the first in there and getting 50p off a fucking sausage roll. But secretly I enjoy it. I like the challenge, I like to test my capabilities of being a bargain basement turd. Oh my fucking God, I'm bored out my blicking dome, I swear to God. It is, it's getting panic stations now, it's uh, code red. But uh, let's not get bogged down by all that bullshit. Um, I've got enough to eat, so I'm fortunate. And, uh, yeah. <laughs> and I've got a few bargains along the way. Oh, fuck about it. <laughs> Buongiorno. How you doing? Um, I'm looking for somewhere to park. I mean, I've got a few places. Um, well, I've got loads of places, actually, where I can go. But uh, I thought I'd try something new. It's another industrial estate. Pretty much all industrial estates are the same, kind of. Um, but at the top of this hill, um, it's all taken, all the spaces are taken. So I'm left at there, and it's an incline like that. It don't look like it on camera, but it's... Um, um, it's on a slope. It's on the piss. So... Uh, and I can't be having that because that would mess with my feng shui and, um, you know, be like the Krypton factor trying to dunk a fucking custard cream into my tea. So uh, I can't have that. That would do my dome in. I've done it before where I've not realised it's been like, I don't know how I've not realised, but uh, I parked on a slope and you either wake up with pains in your legs or pains in your head or both. So I'm going to find another place uh, ASAP because I've got food in, in the fridge in the back of the van and I'm fucking starving. So, um... I'll bring you back. Yeah, I've found a place. Uh, it's nothing exciting. It's uh, it's not even an industrial estate. It's just a road which seems to be quiet. Uh, I've parked here before. During the day, I had. I've never parked here at night. Um, and even more so now, considering what everything was going on, it's even quieter. So, happy days. But uh, I'll flick you around just quickly. I don't think you can see any of that, but it's just a... Your box standard road. We have, we've all seen them. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm going to dive in the back and I'm going to shut up on my face. And uh, I'll see you in a second. Uh, yeah, it seems to be quiet anyway. So, And I like parking in between cars as well because if there's anything going on, they've got to hit the other car unless they come sideways on. I can't do a lot about that. But uh, yeah, I'm sure my Teddy Ruxman would uh, help me out. Cushion the below. Right, I'll uh, I'll see you in a bit. Look at that for entertainment. I can't you can't see him. Hold on, let me get the keys in ignition. He's right, having a right old good chat with himself. What are you trying to do, right? I right, will keep on. Get the keys in ignition. Do the windscreen wipers. And you can see that chap there, right? This is about as exciting as my life gets. He's having a good old chat with himself, well, there's nothing wrong with that, right? I'm not trying to say he's like mental or nothing, but he's having a good old chat with himself, and he's flicking a cup, uh, sorry, he's flicking a, like a plastic bottle, and he's trying to catch it in a cup. I jest you not. <laughs> look, he's stopped now, look. He's stopped, he's probably, there he is. Yeah, he's probably uh, cracked it. But I can hear, hear him saying to himself every freaking time. <laughs> <sighs> <laughs> He's having a white old uh, like moment with himself, you know what I mean? Yeah, never mind. All right, I'll bring you, bring you back. All right, this is where I've uh, ended up. Can you see the lights on in there? No, you can, well, can you? You can now. I'll we'll be looking right at the angle. That's, uh, oh, Jesus, you know what? <laughs> I thought a nice opening shot. I forgot I haven't made my bed. Oh, that was right at the back of my neck, that was. Uh, yeah, so just forget to wash it up and uh, 
Yeah, there we go. So this is where I'm going to be. That car, oh, mate, it's a noise. Fucking hell, spells. All right, this is where I'm going to be for the rest of the nights, I think. See you in a bit. Right, I'm all sorted. Tea is done. Um, heating. Yep, it's coming on. Uh, let's take this, take this time. Oh, I did. Uh, the other day, well, it wouldn't come on. I had the air vent blocked with, uh, so we get for not making your bed. The covers were blocking the vent, so um, yeah, it wouldn't come on. Let me just sort out the vid now, so soon. Good to go. Uh, glasses engaged. Um, what am I going to be doing? Watching the TV. Watching the TV. Uh, yeah. Um, I'm going to have, uh, have a, well, an epic tea. Might have a couple of cheeky biscuits with it. It's about as exciting as it gets. Do you know what? I've never quite closed the door of uh, Benny Hill from growing up in the nine, uh, 80s. And uh, it's the stupid things that make me laugh, you know. <clears throat> Just, I bought a packet of Tesco's uh, bake wall tarts because I'm partial to a bake wall tart. And uh, I was going to do like a gag with two bake wall tarts. And, ha, 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 ha. and I thought, what am I doing? I'm nearly 50, you spanner. <laughs> I've never closed that door. I find them sort of things funny. But I've could be watching telly um, in here and flicking through the channels and that and uh, I could be like random like two o'clock in the morning I'm flicking through and it's usually shopping channels and adverts and all that sort of shit and uh, I hear the beginning of uh, Minder and I'm like get in there things like that 30 odd years ago more than that 40 odd years ago and I used to watch that with my dad and I'm like go on get in there bit of uh, Dennis McCann giving him a bit of a backhander you know you, you, you know Anything where, you know, it might kick off a little bit. I love all that. Um, a bit of a ruck down in the exit. Yeah. <laughs> oh, never mind. Uh, yeah. <laughs> um, yes, yeah, quite enough down it. Is that coming out there? Yep. Yeah. It's uh, quite enough Quite enough around here. So uh, I'm good to go. Uh, yep. I've got me little uh, me cameras there, so if anything, I've already told you know, if it's watch my channel. Get ca if you're going to live in a van um, or whatever you're going to do, part time in a van or whatever, get some cameras for the outside. It just puts the old mind at rest, you know. And um, yeah, just in case you, uh, you hear bumps in the night, and uh, yeah, like three, you know, don't care how big we are, you know what I mean? Like three, four o'clock in the morning when it's fuck all about. And you hear some strange sort of X-Files outside your door. You know, the old uh, the old bum is a bit like a wizard's sleeve. You know, you're like, what the fuck? Especially I can't get in the front, so I've got to meet them on the way out. You know, it's nice to have a camera. Because we don't, we don't want a baggy batty at three o'clock in the morning, do we? It's not a good look. But, uh, yeah, so uh, cameras, good tip. All right, I'm going to shut up and uh, actually I'm going to find something. I tell you what, it's another good thing. The, that telly I've got as well, that's, that's superb. I'd like to do a proper review on it one day. And it was a freebie as well, but never missed a beat. But uh, I'd like to find something decent on. Right, um, I'll bid you a good day. Have a, have a lovely evening. Right, I'll catch you later. Salam.